All right, guys, pardon the uh, little bit of a mess in the garage, but I'm just going to real quickly run over the TRD skid plate. There's a billion videos of it on YouTube, so I'm not going to be showing you much of anything you haven't seen. But this is not going to be some 13-minute video running over an install. So if you are to remove your factory skid, you've just got some bolts that are similar to these patterns right here. You can pull up a video, easy breezy. Along this area here, there's a hook that supports the uh, factory, really splash guard more than skid plate. You take that off, remove it from those hangers, and it just drops right out. Now, one thing I do wanna cover is that mine only shipped with these four pieces of hardware. I'm not talking about the trap door for the oil change. So moving a little further back, you've got these two guys back here which are actually ones that support the factory splash guard. So they came from up here or back here. The factory uses all smaller hardware. And if yours doesn't ship with all six pieces of hardware, which apparently is quite common, that is an easy remedy that'll get you set back up and gives the vehicle a nice aesthetic. It's a good lightweight skid option. There's definitely tougher ones out there, but it kind of completes the look of the Toyota TRD setup. Um, also, I'll have a video covering these LED fogs a little while later, but uh, as for now, just a quick thing on the skid. Find yourself a video on how to install it if you want to get it, and yes, the TRD Pro skid is comparable or compatible with all your SR5 models, off-road, anything. Gen 2s and Gen 3s are also interchangeable. Thanks for watching, guys.